A typical Friday night in a Glasgow bar ended in scenes of barely imaginable horror. A helicopter suddenly plunged into the roof, leading to 10 people dying, with many more injured. Fireman Frank McEwen worked all night on the rescue operation, but Frank is also a footballer, and later that day he was needed to captain his club Stranra in their Scottish Cup match against Clyde. You're there to do a job, and just like anybody else has got a job to do, and uh, you've got to think obviously about the, the families and the victims and things, but uh, you've just got to do your job, and, and it's important that um, the incident goes as, as smoothly as possible. And, um, the dignity of the people that were there, you know. What time did you leave the, the crash scene? I left about maybe half seven, eight o'clock that morning, uh, and then straight home, and then obviously on to the football. It was a big game, uh, so I was always going to play, and um, I was glad I did play, you know. While his teammates can rely on their captain, he knows how important their support has been too. He says this squad are like a family. Deep down, I knew when I heard about it that it'd be fine uh, because I was the kind of guy he is, you know. But I just had to double check, make sure the decision was made on him. I couldn't make the decision for him because uh, he's the one who went through what happened the night before. The club is semi professional, playing in the third tier of the Scottish League, so many of the players have to juggle football with their day jobs. In this case, the cup replay against Clyde. If football does still have a soul, maybe it can be found in Stranra. Formed in 1870, the third oldest club in Scotland, one of the oldest in the world. And Stranraer in blue responded to conceding a goal by scoring four of their own. The goal that put them in front was scored by Frank, the right man at the right time. One more win for Stranraer will equal their best ever performance in the cup. A revered manager born in this part of the world, Bill Shankly, famously remarked that football is not a matter of life and death. It's more important than that. If anyone has the right perspective on this, it's Frank McEwen. It's just a game at the end of the day. Um, yeah, it's a release for a lot of people. Um, but it's, it's just a game. Um, it makes you appreciate what you've got. It makes you appreciate how lucky you are. Lee Wellings, Al Jazeera, Glasgow.